I have just arrived in Prague. I am in our Airbnb and I could not be more proud of myself. This place is huge. We have our own kitchen, we have two bedrooms, and she even left a bottle of wine and some coffee for us. And just around that corner is downtown. So I'm about to head out, try to catch sunset, because I'm alone for the next two hours and I'm waiting on two of my friends to get here. I'm here in Regrovi Sadi Park, which is a park with beautiful views of the city. It's near my Airbnb. I sprinted here so that I could get the back ends of a beautiful sunset, as you can kind of see behind me. This is definitely a good spot for a full view of Prague. We are walking to Old Town now. It is the first morning in Prague, and my friends have arrived. So, so we are going to Old Town because there are a lot of spots to visit there. And first, first things first, we need to find a coffee shop. And then second things second, we, we're gonna go see the astronomical clock. <laughs> We have made it to Old Town and everywhere you look there's a beautiful building, it's all colors. Behind me is the astronomical clock which is a famous tourist spot of Prague. It was installed in 1410 and it's actually the oldest astronomical clock that's still working and it's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, no, she's got friends here. Currently sitting at the top of Prague, Prague. <laughs> next to the castle and this is the view of the city behind me with all the colorful rooftops and a bunch of tourists to my right and we are also tourists but <laughs> that's okay. I, I don't know if it works when I press, press, press it. Okay, maybe I take a 100. Uh, <laughs> oh shoot, it's recording. So we are currently inside the St. Vitus Cathedral, which is huge. And it was reconstructed in 1560 because of a fire years before. John Lennon wall, uh, made by John Lennon himself. I can't believe John Lennon made this whole thing. <laughs> we finally made it to the actual Charles Bridge after the Lennon wall and after being on that bridge, way over there, it's got a beautiful view. And we were hackled to uh, take a boat ride, but um, we're not gonna do that today because it's too cold. <laughs> it's a specialty in Czechoslovakia. It is called a chimney cake, or otherwise known. Thank you. Otherwise known as a trittle mix, I think that's how you pronounce it. But yeah, there are these sweet treats, they kind of look like churros, but I got one with chocolate inside, so. Oh, I should have gotten napkins. Yeah, 100%. Right behind me, uh, kind of high up, if you can see that, is Sigmund Freud, hanging seven feet tall above the streets of Prague. And uh, the artist of that sculpture is David Cerny. So this is just a representation of his depression. <laughs> Hanging. Artist representation. Artistic representation it's, of his doctors. According, this is all facts from Kat. Um, but yeah, apparently he um, was depressed and killed himself. Back at the Charles Bridge for sunset. We're about to leave Prague and our flight's late, so we were able to sleep in this morning. All in all, it's a huge city with a lot of things to do. Um, really colorful and the people are super friendly. I don't know what I'm saying, guys. 
<laughs> well, how do I conclude this? Someone Peace help out. me. Peace Peace out, Prague. <laughs> That's my ending. <laughs>